All right, hey guys. It's been a hot minute since I've actually sat down and filmed a video, but you know, that's okay. <laughs> Okay, so for today's video, we're doing a like February collective haul. I don't know if all these items were bought during February, probably like a few in January, but most of them were bought in February. So I have just now realized that I have a shopping addiction, but that's totally fine. <laughs> so yeah, let's get started on this haul. Okay, so to start off, I'm gonna be starting off with Shein. They don't have like a store in Arizona, but they just had their pop-up shop like this past weekend. Yeah, they just had their pop-up shop, so I had to go, of course. <laughs> this is their bag. I'm not gonna show you like all the bags because they don't matter, but I just thought that their bag was so cute. It's very reminiscent of a Chanel shopping bag, so I kept it and it's really nice quality. It's like basically cardstock. Yeah, but anyways, you guys don't care about their bags. Okay, so the first items I got from them are these cute little purses. I got this one, as you guys can tell from like everything that I wear. I'm obsessed with animal print. This is a very warm brown, almost orangey snake print. It's super cute. It also comes with this strap. It was literally $9. Hashtag fast fashion. I probably won't ever be using this strap unless I wanted to use this as like a little shoulder bag, but yeah, I really like when you just hold little bags like this with your outfit. Um, and then it does have this little card pouch right here, so that's super convenient. It doesn't have one on the inside, they just plastered it on the outside instead. And then next bag I got is definitely my favorite. This was only $12 and it's literally so cute. Jacquemus, who is she? The strap is like shoulder length, but I made it so it's super short because that's how I like to carry my bags. <laughs> it's very tiny, but um, I can fit all the things that I carry with me in here because I literally only like to carry around my wallet and chapstick. But when I go out at night, I obviously keep my taser on me so that won't fit in here. <laughs> Alright, and then the next item that I got is this little skort right here. Yeah, okay, it looks like this. <laughs> Um, it just has this little whippy thing right here, kind of like a belt, but not really at all. This was $10. I got it in a size small. Definitely wish that they had extra small because I had to safety pin it like four inches, but that's just because my body's very small. But yeah, still very cute, worth the $10. I love snake print <laughs> once again. And the next item I got is very cute. This is just little babe tank top. We're going into spring and in Arizona that means 80 degrees. So you're literally sweating outside, but it's fine. This was $5. It's a size small. Fits very well. I just love this color so much. It's so cute. And catch me wearing this literally every day in spring and summer. So. And then the last item is the one that I'm like so happy about it's this little scarf right here it is so cute you can wear it on your head your neck as a shirt i styled it as a shirt as you guys can tell and this was only three dollars and it actually feels really nice um it doesn't feel like cheap quality all right so that is all for shein next i'm going to do nordstrom i only got one thing from here but I had the bag sitting around anyway, so I just put it in the bag. <laughs> so I got these jeans. I'm not gonna like unfold them or anything because I would do that. Um, these jeans were $70. Um, personally, I own two pairs of jeans. The other pair is from Goodwill and I got them for $5. So this was a pretty steep price for me. But they do fit really well. I wish they were longer, obviously, but what are you gonna do when your waist is literally 23 inches and you have the legs the length of a six foot tall man? Yeah. But yeah, that's besides the point. They fit really well. <laughs> um, I bought them because I had to do my digital, so I needed black jeans. And Nordstrom was the only store that had something that remotely fit my body, so 
that's what I got. I just, whatever, on the price because I'm gonna need them literally forever anyway, so. All right, so the next thing that I got are from H&M. I bought these sweatpants out in New York while I was there at the one on Fifth Avenue. That H&M is literally so beautiful. It's like five stories. Yeah, I would like to live there. Don't mind all the cat hair on them. Yeah, but they just fit really well. I just really wanted some sweatpants specifically from H&M because they have the best sweatpants ever. So I got a pair. Don't know how much those were, probably like $15, not too bad. The next thing is this dress. Can't really hold it up in a way that you'll see, but this is a try on haul anyway, so you're gonna be looking at it right now. <laughs> um, yeah, but I just really liked the pattern. I love tiger print, I love all animal prints. I really want some cow print things, but those are very difficult to find, especially for a reasonable price, so I'll just get what I can. But yeah, this dress is actually really nice quality. It's just like a nice cute little wrap dress, um, perfect for springtime and like church and stuff like that, some brunch, wherever you want to wear it. <laughs> I just really like this dress. Oh, and it was on clearance for like six dollars, so that was even better. All right, next is Forever 21. <laughs> I had a serious problem with Forever 21, and I wouldn't even say that my favorite store is Forever 21, but I had the most items from them, so that's just a whole debacle. The first thing I got from them is these cute crocodile print midnight blue heels. They have every trend that I like in them. The crocodile print, the square toe, that's like, and a nice block heel. These are it. And then next is this cute little purple purse. I love this thing so much. I wore it for like two weeks straight after I got back from New York. I actually like put it on in the store. Like I changed purses as soon as I bought it because it matched my outfit. Oh yeah, if you haven't seen my New York vlog, definitely go check that out because New York is fun and who doesn't want to watch behind the scenes of Fashion Week, so yeah um but yeah i just really liked this chain on it um personally i never buy anything with silver hardware or silver jewelry or literally anything silver but i thought that this was really cute so i got it and then the last thing i got from forever 21 is this gorgeous All right, my camera stopped recording, but anyways, we're back. Okay, like I was saying, the next thing I got is definitely one of my favorites, and it's these Jordans right here. Take a gander. <laughs> here you go. Um, they're so beautiful. I honestly just have no words, so. Yeah, I love them. And then I just got some socks with them too. These were like $18 which was annoying because they're just socks but i wanted to be like the cool kids all right next is zara so my first purchase from zara tag is salon i got this for ten dollars pretty sure i got this in new york too oh my gosh i forgot to mention i got this tank top from forever 21 as well <laughs> here it is here's the try on part of it Okay, yeah, back to Zara. <laughs> yeah, so I got this in New York. Um, apparently, this is the back side with all of the silver and pearl detailing. I had no idea. I definitely tried it on backwards in the store and in this try-on haul, it's on backwards. And <laughs> I definitely would have worn it backwards if I wore it yet. But yeah, so I guess this is the front. Kind of boring. Yeah, but whatever. Maybe I'll wear it backwards when I actually do wear it. Okay, so next is these shorts. Very cute. Summer in the Hamptons shorts type vibe right here. They're just super cute. Some nice tweed shorts. And then next is this nice cute coat thing. It's like what all those YouTuber girls wear out all the time. Just like a big fuzzy bear coat so super comfy 
I'm pretty sure this was like $40. It was on sale at Zara as well. All right, and last but not least, definitely my favorite item ever is this coat from Mango. I love this coat so much. I just really can't get over it. I got it in an extra small, so I don't know if I'd say it's oversized. It's just like a thick coat. So keep that in mind when you're buying. This was $80 on sale at Mango. Kind of steep, but honestly, for the quality and everything, this was really fire. I love this coat so much. It's going to be in literally all of my photos. <laughs> But yeah, that is all for the haul. Let me know if you guys want me to do more try-on hauls and show you guys what I've just been buying here and there because I shop a lot. So yeah, if you guys like this video, definitely give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Post me on all your social media if you want to. Subscribe if you want to. Turn on post notifications if you want to. Yeah, I'll see you guys later.